College Football Week Zero Breakdown starts with Florida State-Georgia Tech Clash. If you think Week Zero is a strange designation, you might have an even harder time wrapping your head around this little factoid. A half a dozen members of the football championship subdivision will have played two games by the end of Week 1. What's more, one team will have already played two conference games. Bearing all that in mind, however, Week Zero presents an abbreviated slate, with just four games involving FBS squads. But for true fans of the sport, this jump start to the season will definitely whet the appetite. Here's a quick look at the Saturday schedule. All the college football news to know. Sign up for USA Today's sports newsletter. Number 10 Florida State vs. Georgia Tech in Dublin, noon Eastern Time. ESPN The Easy Choice for Headliner of the Day finds the Seminoles and Yellow Jackets leaping straight into ACC play overseas. It is in fact the first of two consecutive conference contests for FSU, which will play host to Boston College on Labor Day night to close out Week 1. Florida State is the lone ranked team to take the field on opening day and will be significantly favored. But the Yellow Jackets pulled off some upsets in 2023 and have enough returning talent to make a game of this one. The defenses might have the upper hand in the early stages. Newly arrived Seminoles QB DJ Wiangalale and a rebuilt receiving core must negotiate a Georgia Tech secondary featuring DB Clayton Powley. That could be the unit's strongest group. Yellow Jackets QB Haynes King has a year in the system under his belt, but will face a nasty FSU pass rush led by D. Patrick Payton. Montana State at New Mexico for PM Eastern Time. FS1 The Lobos are the first of three Mountain West squads playing at home in Week Zero. They'll look to get the Bronco Mendenhall era in Albuquerque off on the right foot. The but they'll likely get a stiff test from the Bobcats, perennial playoff contenders in the football championship subdivision ranked fourth in the preseason FCS coaches poll. Montana State's strength is its ground game, a big part of which is mobile QB Tommy Malott. Finding real estate could be difficult against an FBS-caliber defense, even a rebuilt one like New Mexico's. The Lobos' attack will be in the hands of QB Devin Dampier, and his primary WR Caleb Medford is a candidate for a breakout season. Left out, five teams snubbed in the preseason top 25 ranking what T.O. know. Outlooks for every team in preseason poll SMU at Nevada, 8 p.m. Eastern Time. CBS SN among the trio of Mountain West clubs in action on Saturday. The Wolfpack are the only ones hosting another bowl subdivision team. The Mustangs will get an early taste of life on the road as they embark on their new era in the ACC. Nevada is not exactly expected to contend in the MWC, so any SMU struggles might set off alarm bells among its fans even on the road. Incumbent QB Preston Stone could quell any potential anxieties quickly if he gets the Mustangs rolling early. Delaware State at Hawaii, 11.59 p.m. Eastern Time. You'll have to stream this one if you're curious. And Rainbow Warrior fans had better hope there is little drama as Timmy Chang's third campaign helming his alma mater kicks off. His team would do well, however, to remember Howard, another meek squad, pulling off a historic upset of fellow Mountain West member UNLV back in 2017. Nevertheless, Hawaii will want to make short work of this one with UCLA coming to the islands next week, and the Delaware State's travel woes getting to Honolulu undoubtedly didn't help their own preparations. Wanna bet? These are the top NCAA football betting promos and bonuses in 2024 Babuda's News.